Hello and welcome to another video of Yocto tutorial series. In this video we are going to learn about extra oimake variable of Yocto. Before we start I would like to say that this video is a continuation of the previous video OE Runmake. So if you haven't watched that video please watch that first and then watch this video otherwise it would be difficult for you to understand. So what is extra OE run uh, OE make variable. So the variable is used within Yocto recipe files to customize the build process of a specific software component or package. It allows you to pass additional arguments to the make command use, used during the compilation of the software. But why do we use it? We, we can use it for customization for the giving the optimization peri uh, parameters to the uh, compiler giving debugging parameters to a compiler for dependency and portability. Let us check this with an example. So in previous video we have seen this advanced calculator recipe. So I have changed it a little bit. Previously we have only one file libmath but right now we have lib, lib, lib add subtract multiply. And here we have the make file. If you see in lib add we only have add function in lib subtract we have subtract function in lib multiply we have multiply function in addition to that I have a make file in make file I also made some changes target I put advanced calculator this would be our binary that will be installed in our final image these are the library files these files that we are using these three files and the main source file is actually the target.c file so now let us begin and build see what happens so this is my previous setup and in compile I am using OE run make as you know that OE run make looks for the make file and, uh, and compile the final binary and here we also have used the OE run make to install the compiled file into the destination so these dest dir and bin dir actually are the variables in make file as you can see in the install here dest dir and bin dir but they are given through the oe run make to the make file they are passed by oe run make so first of all let us build and see what happens so i am running come on, first let me clean the setup so we can analyze it better So now I am building the whole image. So as you can see that the image has been built successfully. But now it doesn't seem very clean to put these variables here. There should be a way to make it more clean so for that extra OE make comes into game so the syntax is extra underscore OE make and then we'll do append if you don't know how append works please watch my previous video on uh, variable operators and then we put equal and these two will put here inside OE make. We'll remove it from here and instead of that we'll put it here. These two will be passed to the make file through this OE make variable, Yocto variable. And now let us build it once again. So as you can see that this time the Im image has also been built successfully. Now let us make some more changes. If you see the make file, we have hard coded these values target 
libs and source but I don't want to hard code them these two things we can pass through our OE uh, this extra OE make variable so let's do it first of all this is uh, one more uh, operator in Yocto if you don't know about this please watch my previous video on uh, variable operators and you will find it how it works so it is also valid in bash uh, in make so first of all let me remove this from here and put an inverted commas so if we put inverted commas this is this question mark equal shows the default values and let me just remove this from here also and put two commas inverted commas so now let me go back to calculator and here what I can do is I can do extra uh, first of all let me declare, declare a vari variable for lips I will say lips and equal and these three as a variable but there is a problem we cannot pass them just like that to the OE run make because we have spaces in between them we should use the spa escape sequence so make will understand them otherwise we will get an error so here is the escape sequence then what we will do is we will do extra OE make dot append again and then again we will do like this this time first of all we have to give the target so what is the target target is nothing but our package name this package name so instead of hard code this also I am giving here just the package name so if you don't know the package name check my video on basic Yocto variables and secondly we want to give the lips so the lips here is the variable of lips is lips small lips with the small alphabets here we have a big capital alphabets so I will say lips equals and dollar and I will say lips so now these two will be passed to the make file and it should also build this time successfully so now let us build it once again we have an error this time let me check what's wrong so actually that was a typo instead I, I missed the R here that's why it was uh, not compiling but right now it is compiling so as you can see that this time the image has also been built successfully without any error so this is all about OE Runmic now let us check if this is working properly let me put the setup so now I am connected to Beagle Bone Black and now let us check if it is working so it is ADV and then tab and then calculator so as you can see that this time it is also working and we have addition subtraction and multiplication furthermore we can also pass debugging parameters uh, to OE run make uh, extra OE make we can also pass some optimization parameters to it so this is all about OE run make OE make hope you like the video please like and subscribe my channel and I will see you in the next video thanks for watching